There are many well-known stories and legends about Old Fort Herod and its occupants, but our favorite story is a true story about a pig that would become the fort's official mascot. On one occasion, about 400 men from Fort Herod were called into service to the Colonial Army to fight the British and Indians in the north. Those 400 Kentucky riflemen started marching north from Fort Herod to muster up with the main army of about 4,000 troops. About 10 miles north of Fort Herod, they came upon two young pigs fighting to the death. The men watched with curiosity as those two pigs fought. Eventually, one prevailed. Thinking the excitement was over, the men marched on. But that pig wanted to join up. He fell in line with the men and marched beside them all the way to Canada. The pig lived on the scraps thrown out to it by the 400 men. He marched when they marched. He took breaks with them. He slept when they slept. The men adopted him as their official mascot. When they came to the Ohio River, the pig jumped in and swam all the way across by himself. He would not ride the ferry with the men. He swam faster than the ferry and was waiting for them on the other side. When they came to Lake Erie, that pig balked. He would not cross the lake. No amount of coaxing would persuade him. The troops had to march on without him, and all thought that would be the last time they would ever see the pig. Those 400 men fought valiantly for 10 months against the British and Indians and succeeded in defeating them. After the battle, the survivors returned across Lake Erie and could not believe their eyes. There, on the south bank, was that same pig, still waiting after ten months. As they marched by, the pig fell back in with them and marched beside them all the way back to Fort Herod. When the men had arrived at the fort weeks later, they were met by the residents of the fort with a big pig roast. But that pig didn't have to worry. He was not eaten. Governor Isaac Shelby personally took that pig in and put him on his farm where he lived out his life eating to his heart's content. And that is the true story about the pig that would become Fort Herod's official mascot.